Hey everybody, it's Dave from Projected People back today to show off a very special projector. This is the Sony VPL VW 285ES True 4K projector. Great, welcome back everybody. Today we are taking a look at the Sony True 4K VPL VW 285ES SXRD projector. This projector actually came out in 2017, but we're talking about it right now, right after Cydia 2018, because there's a new model being released. 90% of that new model is the same as this 285. So I know that you guys want to know a lot about that model. No one has a unit yet really to demo. We have this one, let's talk about it. This 285, in short, is an incredible projector. It's a dedicated home theater unit. Let's get that out of the way first and foremost. This is a 1500 lumen unit meant for a dedicated controlled space where you can turn off all the lights. 1500 lumens is more than enough to get an image that is just going to blow your mind. The contrast on this projector, we've seen it in action, incredible for having no dynamic iris. Uh, I don't know how much better you could, you could probably get a little better, but not much uh, than this projector out of the box. It's got a fantastic two times zoom. It's got lens shift out of this world for placement flexibility. Uh, it's got HDR support for HDR 10 and BT 2020. It's got reality creation. It's got everything that makes a Sony projector so desired by the aficionados and the video community. It's got 3D super low lag input times, and number one on the list for a lot of people is the fact that it does native 4K, and it displays 4,096 pixels by 2,160 pixels. There's no pixel shifting going on, there's no kind of manipulation of the processor. This is true 4K out of the box, and it shines. It looks incredible, as you'll see in just a minute. Let's talk about the connections on the back of this unit. Great, so we are now looking at the input connections on the Sony. And just for reference, this is the side of the unit here. Uh, we have from left to right, we've got your network control, your local area network, your USB, probably for firmware upgrades and so on. You have two HDCP uh, 2.2 uh, connections, so both of these will support 4K. Um, you have your uh, standard kind of uh, remote connection for your uh, computer and then you have an IR and direct and you have two uh, different options for your 12 volt triggers there so nothing you don't need everything you do need uh, for a functional home theater unit and this chassis I'll just speak to that for a minute um, this is definitely not a portable unit this is meant to be installed it's a 31 pound uh, unit with a very nice sleek kind of carbon uh, outer shell beautiful unit 